Well, at Point Lobos, we've got lots and lots of patterns and shapes, and many of these are caused by animals that lived 50 million years ago. They lived on the floor of the submarine canyon, and they made tubes that they lived in, or in some places they just swam through the sand and mud, but they left their mark, and these rocks are full of the marks of these ancient animals. Some we can make a guess as to what they are, and some of them we don't have a clue. Well, these rocks are different from the ones we saw before. They're thick sandstones, and they've got some really strange patterns in them. And they're standing at a very steep angle. They're standing up almost straight up. And these were beds that originally were flat, and now they've been pushed up by some sort of great force in the earth. And in these sandstones, this rock here, we have some very, very strange features. They're a different color, they stand out differently, and there are really strange markings around the outside of these. These are called concretions. These are a mass of sand that got cemented ahead of the rest of the rock, and then the rest of the rock was cemented around it, but because they're two different cements, these break out and stand in these weird forms that we see in the rocks. And around Point Lobos, you can see some beautiful examples. Some of them are perfect circles. Some of them look like fossil Volkswagen. And there's one that third graders tell me is a dinosaur footprint.